here at the beautiful Ocean Key Marine Reserve, MSC's private island retreat. And it is a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful little island. Um, a little history about this island, if you did not know, it used to be a giant trash pile, but MSC decided to buy it and turn it into the gorgeousness that it is today. They completely revamped the island, built up the coral and replanted trees and turned it into a really beautiful nature resort. It's not the same as what you may think of for other cruise lines private islands. This one is purely for a beach day and relaxation. It doesn't have the water slides. It doesn't have all the big giant pools if you're gonna get in the water. It is the ocean. Um, so just know that. But they do have some things like jet skis and kayaks and stand-up paddle boards for you to be able to go and do that kind of fun. But it is purely for relaxation and enjoyment of the water and just taking in all the beauty of nature. They do have a really cool lighthouse over there that is going to do, we'll show you some of that later on. But right now we gotta go find some breakfast because we slept in and we gotta find some food because we're kind of hungry right now. But we just wanted to say good morning and to let you know where we are. What's up? What's up? We are now awaiting for our trolley to come pick us up from the yacht club like area and we're gonna go to the ocean house which is like the private beach part of the Ocean K Island for the yacht club uh, yacht club guests. So we're super excited to see how the that part of the island looks. But we'll show you some of the rest of the island and parts of Ocean Key too. We made it to the exclusive Yacht Club area. This particular um, restaurant is called the Ocean House and this is exclusively for Yacht Club members. And um, we're gonna order some drinks and then we're gonna see what's on the menu. And then we're gonna show you the beautiful, private, pristine beach that they have over here. I'm looking, if you can see the, hold on, I gotta show you. Cause if you can see the water from here, just look at that beautiful aqua marine color. Beautiful. Beautiful aquamarine color. Everything looks amazing. Um, the crab ceviche sounds really, really good, but I think I'm gonna go with the charred octopus salad. Be a little adventurous, since we had octopus in Palermo, remember? Yeah, yeah. And um, I'm thinking the lobster roll is my entree, cause can't go wrong with a lobster roll. And then of course, creme caramel for dessert but the menu looks amazing, y'all. So it is an absolutely beautiful day here at Ocean K. You know, I love the fact that MSC decided to take an abandoned island, completely change it into a natural preserve to preserve the coral, the beach, the landscape, and to help the economy here in the Bahamas. I can tell you right now, this is very restful, very peaceful. There's still some construction going on across the island that they were telling us about, but that, as Adrian says, the blue, absolutely amazing. So, if you're looking for a relaxing cruise, you just want to get away. I know there's some cruise lines that have private islands that are just like, wow. Ocean Key is more for just relaxing, a great beach day, chilling with the family. And of course, later on tonight, they're going to have the Junkanoo Parade. Really looking forward to that. And then they're going to also do the lighthouse 
light show. So that should be really, really good. Um, if you got any questions, man, make sure you put them down in the comments. Let us know uh, what you like that you've seen about Ocean K or what you would like to see about Ocean K. So how you feel about the day, baby? Ocean Key is okay with me. <laughs> I like that. Ocean Key is okay with me. Yeah, I like that. It's hot yeah, though. It's hot. But a uh, beautiful island, just a nice beautiful place island. to come chill. Just chill. That's what we've been doing Post all day. Chilling. With a nice drink and a nice book. All right. And then go chill in the water when you get too hot. And put that on repeat. <laughs> it's 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 a beautiful beautiful island i can't wait to see it when it's fully matured like in another maybe five years oh wow yeah then it's going to really really be gorgeous because right now all the trees are still young and the coral is just now starting to develop but give it five years it'll be beautiful this is how we do it. Beautiful day at Ocean K. It's a beautiful day at Ocean K. Start stepping up. It's a beautiful day at Ocean K. Oh man, look at the ship back there, y'all. Ocean K is gorgeous. Like this is definitely a spot you want to come if you want to relax and just have a chill day. No pressure, no stress. You can chill over here at the lighthouse, which is going to turn up a little bit later on tonight. We're out in the water right now. Oh man, this is great. How you feeling, baby? This is beautiful. I'm in my happy place in the water. Float, float on. Float on. Float on. It's about to take me away, though. The girl is short. <laughs> We're gonna take our slow sweet time getting back home and enjoy the sea day. Yeah, man. And get into some shenanigans on the ship. Yeah, man. All the fun things. All the fun things. On that right there. Right there. The mirror like. building. Y'all, Terry done learned how to float. Teach a dog new tricks. Who said you can't teach an old dog new tricks? What? <laughs> Crete, what, are, what are you going to do? Oh. 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 <laughs> so I get the gold medal? How was my form? Did it look right? Tell them a little bit about the beach that we're on right now. Okay, so right now we're at Lighthouse Beach because of the lighthouse back there. But we came to this side versus staying at the Yacht Club Beach 
because the water was actually kind of rougher because it's more on the other side of the ocean. So, as you can see, the waves are much, much calmer on this side. It feels so good. And it feels so much better. So we came over here to relax and play in the water. But you can also see that we're over here at a different time of day. Because earlier today, it was more filled with the families and the little ones and the babies. So if that's your jam and you want to hang out with the little ones or if you have little ones and you want to hang out on the beach, this beach, along with the family lagoon, has the calmer water as well. the light show tonight but as you can see oh. it's raining on us right now so oh. no, light show. no light show we'll have to show y'all that at some other time i don't even know if y'all can see way down there i may have to try and zoom in but when it start raining like a downpour you got to start jigging the umbrellas off the beach oh my God. wet hair don't care good morning good morning sea days well we're having some coffee and um some continental breakfast um because Addie can't survive without coffee. her coffee <laughs> but because today's a sea day we're probably just going to take it easy and do some of the fun stuff on the ship of course um probably go and check out the ropes course and maybe the water slides because yeah. this humidity is no joke down here. Me and my son got to get on that F1 simulator. They're Go head to, to head. Got to do that. <laughs> They're dying to do the F1 simulators. And um, we'll see what else happens. Um, there's the bowling alley. Mm -hmm. There's the flight simulator. There's the 4D cinema thing. So And crepes. Oh, we got to do the crepes. <laughs> I almost forgot about the crepes. So yes, <laughs> we got to go visit the Jean-Philippe shop and have some crepes. Yeah. So, first though, some coffee. Hey guys. What's up, what's up? <laughs> All right, so we decided to come up and have a late lunch. We're on deck 19 at the Yacht Club Bar and Grill. This is one of those perks that they have for you. Every day you can come up and get drinks. You can get a very, very nice buffet. It's a little bit different than down below in the Lido, uh, which is something that we really like. When you just want to relax and chill, they've got tons of seating that wraps around um, the front of the ship. You've got a smoking area, you've got a pool, and a hot tub. We like it because it's separate from everybody else, so mm -hmm. you get that whole ship within a ship concept when you're cruising. Right. So we can be up here and have our own little private retreat and hang out and do whatever we want. But if we want to go down to the shops or if we want to go to a show or if we want to do anything like that that's under other parts of the ship, absolutely can so we like the the privacy of the small pool and the whirlpool and being able to just hang out without the hustle and bustle of everybody else lunch time, lunch time, lunch time. Oh, burgers is oh lunch has arrived mm -hmm. cheeseburger and fries what you got over there though? that's the that's your grilled mahi grilled mahi mahi, mahi, mahi and, and some, some rice. rice and i stole a french fry now we're waiting on them drinks here come the good stuff. Thank you. Welcome. So yeah, it's about to go down real serious. Coco Loco looks a little different from the one I had yesterday. Pina colada for Adrian. Told me about that. Again. Oh, yeah. That burger. That's that cruise life right there, boy. That's that cruise life right there. Whew. So my man said he was gonna bring me something back strong. That's what I'm talking about for right. it. So cheers, baby. Cheers. Oh Thank yeah. <laughs> what, what, Terry? <laughs> you good? 
That's some straight gasoline now, right there, boy. <laughs> <laughs> what in the? What did he fix you? He came by like twice and was like, "Yo, you, you want something stronger?" Because I had like a cocoa loco. Yeah, a cocoa loco. He's like, "You want something stronger?" Something stronger. I'll be right back. I got you. <laughs> this is pure gasolina. <laughs> what does it even taste like? You got a line wheel. <laughs> The drink is so strong. They don't have a flavor. It ain't got a flavor. <laughs> Woo! I know it looks like we're like super lazy right now, and we are, <laughs> but this is a first. They brought us ice cream. Or it's a cool ice cream. off. I didn't want any. Uh, vanilla, pistachio, chocolate. Look like it's got some Rice Krispies on here. Oh, shit. Yacht Club, Yacht baby. Yacht Club. <laughs> why are you laughing at me? <laughs> you. Why are you? Why are you laughing at me? In this damn room. <laughs> this is I not can... for a big guy. I'm oh like, my God. Err. Terry said. <laughs> jokes so i we pulled out the yacht club rope uh, we got ready to go to the thermal spa uh, i can't get in it my arms are too big or something or i'm too big he got me crying y'all it's a dad bod violation oh uh, he said it hurt <laughs> we are now entering the thermal suite area of msc aurora spa traditional sauna. One of my favorite rooms, even though I can't stay in there long, is actually the ice room. Where you have, oh it feels good in here right now. It does feel good in here. Actual snow, y'all. Then we have a light sauna, which is still a sauna, but it's not as hot as the traditional sauna. Quiet room over here. And another quiet room over here. And then we have the thermal lasso pool. Thank you. My favorite. These are all different showers that give you either cold blasts or hot blasts. This one right here is a cold storm. This one is a sensory, a light sensory steamer. This one is the bright, and down there is the dark, so it gives you different light, light sensories to help you relax. Unfortunately, the dark one's out of order, but this is the dark room. This right here is a medieval torture device. <laughs> Y'all demonstrate it, eh? It varies from hot to cold to hot to cold. You want me to demonstrate? You want to demonstrate? Uh, I told y'all it's a medieval torture device. <laughs> All right. So you start up with a warm light. And it's like, well, this is decent. Kind of nice. And you stay here and you get nice and warm in the little rain shower. And then it freezes you. <laughs> gives you the same kind of rain shower except now it's freezing cold. Oh, and then it warms you up again with a little bit of a wider spray and then you get a cold mist at the end to freeze you at the end. Medieval torture. Not many people are gonna show you this part of the cruise life. If you can see us, because the lights are gonna change. Yeah. But we're in the steam room in the thermal suite. <laughs> and the lights are changing because it's the aromatherapy, light therapies, or light sensory, whatever it is, to help you relax. And this is yet another one of those perks of being in the Yacht Club. You get free uh -oh. access no matter how long your cruise is to the thermal suite. Of your cruise. You so you can just chill. All day, air day if you wanted to. <laughs> but it don't stop now. After you jump out of 
find something hot. You gotta cool off. Gotta cool off. No perfect way than to head to the ice room. With really, that's how you feel? <laughs> Adrian can better tell you the effects and the benefits of going from hot to cold. Yes, it closes up your capillaries and it causes your heart to actually pump more oxygen. So it's good for your heart to actually go from hot to cold really fast. So it's actually a cardio effect. And it's really good for your skin. Yeah, it's not like taking a cold shower in the morning or something yes, like that. Yes, exactly. I'd rather do this. <laughs> Absolutely. Especially with the other one therapy. <laughs> but yeah, it closes up the pores in your skin, so your skin gets this tightening effect, and it makes your heart pump faster because it's like, oh shoot, you're cold. So you have to, your heart starts pumping more, so you get this cardio invigorating effect. It feels good to me. It's chill. No pun intended. Uh, chill. These are Mediterranean baths. but not as steamy. Um, so you have your hot rocks getting off a heat, but not too hot like a sauna. And you can shower yourself with the individual showers. Then, one of my favorite rooms is the thermal lasso room. With the pool with the so you can lay down in the pool and the heated seats. Quite awesome. So we are about to chill and relax in the thermal area for a minute and we will see you in a little bit. And now we're in one of our favorite places in the thermal suite. The lot so cool. There's so much you can do on this ship. I can I wish we could show you all, and we had like this big idea in our head when we got on board. Oh, we're gonna show this, we're gonna do that, but you know what? The best way to do it is to show you how we experience it just being normal. Yep. You know? We decided to come down to the thermal suite before dinner. Yep. We did the, the sauna and the hydrotherapy rooms. Now we're in the Velocal pool just chilling. I was almost asleep a second ago. <laughs> But yeah, man. It's lovely. To all my friends out there that have doubts about taking a cruise, getting on water, man, come on. Stop Dude. playing. You ain't never gonna wanna do anything else no. but cruise. It's the best vacation ever. And right now, MSC is the best thing going. The value, what you get, the ships, the friendliness of the, the crew. Man, these, it's only been three days. But it's been a fantastic, quick hit of three day trip. Three days. So, uh, we're gonna go back to Chile. Yes. And I guess we'll catch you in the next segment. Yes, ma'am. Whatever that is. <laughs> Bye. That was so. So relaxing. relaxing. Man. Oh, I can't believe in a couple of hours we got to get off this thing. I know. But I uh, it's been a good time, man. Somebody's whistling. I know, right? <laughs> Somebody is happy to be Somebody's working. Very happy. Everybody's happy on MSC. Always. <sighs> whistle while hard. you work. Whistle on. Play on whistle on. So tonight we are having a really special dinner for a send off for this guy here at Butcher's Cut tonight at his favorite steakhouse on MSC Marigold here right now. Um, if you've ever had the pleasure of eating at a steakhouse at sea, it is something truly, truly grand. 
only because for a small extra fee of usually anywhere between $25 to $40, you get a three course, sometimes four course meal of at the fraction of a cost of what you would get on land. So we're gonna show you exactly what we get and show you the perks. Well, guys, it's that day. It's that. Time to get off the boat. Enjoyed it. This weekend was great. Quick was three great. day in and out. Mm -hmm. What was your favorite part? Um, I'm going to say yesterday, our sea day, yeah. where we just relaxed so hard that we didn't want to do anything but sleep. <laughs> the thermal sleep was amazing, and uh, all the staff and crew have been phenomenally happy and gracious and helpful. And just like that, we're signing off. Hope you enjoy the vlogs. If you have any questions, don't forget to go down in the comments. And if this is your first time with us, or if you've been with us and you have not, go ahead and subscribe. We really enjoy that. Click that notification bell to find out when we post the next video. And we'll see you soon. I'm a best man. I'm a baller. Take a deep breath. I'm a shark. You 70s a week. I'll be up on night, day and night, day, day and night.